The antifungal kit, as you can see, comes in a convenient box package. You open that and it reveals the two tubes of antifungal nail balm as well as the antifungal soap. Now the way we use these, I'm going to show you right now. now as you can see, I've got the antifungal nail balm uh, here in my hand. We're going to push a little bit of that up. Uh, the person helping me with the video today obviously does not have fungal toenails, but if she did, you would debride or thin those out uh, to essentially the thickness of a fingernail prior to ap applying this uh, medication. The way you put it on, you take each infected nail and apply some of the antifungal nail balm to the leading edge so that it can absorb up around uh, that portion of the nail. You paint the surface of the nail with it and rub some around the nail fold. You do this on each infected toe. Once a day is good, twice a day is great. And that's all there is to it. You just push it up under the nail, paint the surface, and work some into the nail folds. And that's how the antifungal nail balm is applied. It's easy, it's fast, and uh, uh, patient compliance is pretty high with this particular product. It stays in place uh, much better than the over-the-counter lotions and creams. Uh, because it's in a beeswax base, all the active uh, essential oils and antifungal herbs are held into place or in the, in the position to absorb, allow them to absorb into the uh, toenails uh, throughout the course of the day and night. And it's very effective for us. Uh, the antifungal soap contains uh, both tea tree and lemon balm oils. And I recommend that they use this two to three times a week when bathing. So the antifungal nail balm to be applied twice daily. The soap used every two to three days uh, while bathing. It'll kill any of the fungus uh, between the toes out on the skin of the foot to prevent reinfection. And that's the antifungal nail balm.